Well, the film is uh, the, the the film is set now. It's set in the uh, in today, um, and actually it deals with multiple themes. Patriarchy just happens to be one of the the the, the strong uh, sort of uh, uh, notes that it hits on. Uh, but it's as much a film about family and about the circularity that travels within a family, about the images that travel within a family, how. Uh, the more we we try to escape this one strong image in our family and try to get away physically, uh, the more we actually distance ourselves physically, the more we obsess with uh, increasing that distance, the more we find that that person is deep-rooted uh, within us much more and how we realize years later that we've almost turned into that same person. So that's one of the central themes of the film. Um, and then there's the patriarchy. There's obviously... Uh, we we are as a society uh, probably going through that phase of change where uh, the roles of men and women are changing and and the Indian man probably is today struggling uh, uh, against it a little bit trying to redefine that role and and trying to come to grips with the with where he stands or uh, you know how 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 to grip this whole thing so it's about ultimately we are talking about four men in a house uh, uh, suddenly uh, put in front of a woman, a new woman inside that house. So yes, uh, their behavior uh, uh, to that girl uh, becomes a part of the, the equation uh, naturally, uh, but it's not something that, I, I, I guess what I'm saying is I'm not trying to make a comment on patriarchy. The film is not me trying to tell you something about patriarchy. It's just a story that unfolds with these characters and they behave uh, in certain ways with each other, which all of us behave in. Uh, we have the same patterns, and uh, you just witness this uh, 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 strange, interesting story. And uh, yeah, I, I mean, I, I guess I would like people to uh, make whatever they want to make out of it. So I wouldn't want to bracket it as as just a film about patriarchy. Uh, Kanu, Kanu, uh, yeah. for a film which has patriarchy as such an important theme, the the star cast has four men and just one woman. So is that just uh, just an irony or? Is it like a conscious decision to have just one woman? Because, yeah, well, so that's <laughs> precisely my question. Like, was it 